We can't move to Boston, Grace. Our lives are here. But it's a million dollars, Sam. Uh, it's out of the question. How can you say that? You're not even considering it? There's nothing to consider. Harmony is our home, and that's that. Look, I love this town too, Sam, but I I'm sure you could find another job if that's what's bothering you. Why are you pushing this, Grace? I said no. In all the years we've been married, you have never shut me out of the decision the way you are now. Well, this isn't the same thing as both of us deciding on a color for the girl's bedroom wall. Look, this isn't getting us anywhere. I've got to get back to the station. Look, don't walk out, Sam. Tell me why you're acting like this. I already did. This town is our home. It's my father's home, my grandfather's before that. We've raised our children here. I mean, damn, Grace, you've made a life for yourself here, too. How can you even consider walking away from it just like that? Report contact! question I would ask is why would I do no, it? I don't like that question. I already know why you would do it. I want to know why you think Rachel did it. Do you remember the first time we met? Hmm? Yeah. Do you remember how hesitant I was to let you in at first? Yeah. That was because I didn't know if you were the killer. So what's your point? Do you remember when I was showing you out and Rachel came up? Right. You had a gun pointed on her. I mean, she, she wasn't even scared. Not for a second. I mean, don't you think that was odd? I mean, you have a gun right in her face and she doesn't even flinch. I don't get it. Why should she be afraid of a cop? No, she didn't know I was a cop. For all she knew, I could have been the killer. Oh, God, Bruce. I gotta go. Run him down, boy. Come on, run him down. to go. Did I tell you to go? So what's next? Hello, sweetie. Put her in the truck. Get in. Well, get your hands off the wheel, mister. Yeah, I got her. No! Oh, she's pulling my hair! Will you quit pulling his hair, damn it! Look out! I'm 
just be real quiet for me. And don't make a sound. Thanks for watching. For now, this is Keith Lewis, signing off.